wait a second. Is your excavator working efficiently? Even with the same equipment, your excavator's efficiency differs depending on how you use it. Efficient earth moving work begins with choosing the right location. To help you run a more efficient construction site, let us give you a few tips on how to use your excavator effectively and efficiently. Placing the excavator and dump truck in the appropriate locations during loading work will significantly increase fuel efficiency. Placing the excavator and dump truck at the same height is one of the worst working environments for fuel efficiency. This is because, as the excavator's tracking path of front movement becomes excessively large, the amount of unnecessary movement grows. This results in longer working times and higher energy consumption. Things may vary depending on the work environment. However, when carrying out loading work, the excavator should be positioned higher than the dump truck as much as possible. By minimizing unnecessary movements, work can be done faster and fuel efficiency can be increased. An appropriate standard for the ideal distance of the excavator from the dump truck is a length of the excavator's arm. When one dump truck has been filled, working speed could be reduced by 33%, while fuel efficiency could be increased by 45% or more. During loading work, the swing angle of the excavator also has a big effect on working speed and fuel efficiency. Unnecessary swing movements, in other words, swing movements in which the angles made by the excavator while it is digging and dumping into the truck are too large, cause an increase in work time and a decrease in fuel efficiency. So, what is the optimal movement? The optimal movement is the one that has the absolute smallest radius from the excavator's digging to dumping into the truck. It's possible to improve working speed and fuel efficiency significantly due to reducing swing movement. Can you see the difference now? Occasionally, you'll have to go right ahead and perform excavating work on unstable ground condition without leveling or evening out the ground. Not only is working on unstable ground condition in this way very dangerous, but it also uses more energy and is less fuel efficient, as the excavator has to perform more movements to achieve stability. When the excavator is used on flat ground, it is able to function at full power without any loss of energy. If you must work on inclined region, make sure that you do your leveling first and then conduct your full-scale work on the flattest ground possible. Please remember and use these tips from Doosan as they will help improve your construction work efficiency.